in this video we are going to look at a transaction called SecPol uh, which is basically uh, maintaining security policy so the use case here is basically uh, when you have like for example shop floor user or a warehouse clerk warehouse user where they have a lot of transaction to perform and they are not very technically savvy so you don't want to have a complex password for them so you want to exempt them from having complex passwords so in this case what you can do is you can basically exclude some of the users from having complex passwords let's say for example your company has 14 or 16 character long password but you want the shop floor and warehouse people, warehouse people to have only six character password okay so in that case what you can do is you can create a profile here i created a warehouse profile here you can say attributes click on attributes so for example password uh, special character zero right you don't have to have special character for this one so let's say i want to change this i want to add some more um, you can you password let's say i want to put the password length as only six characters the company policy is uh, 14 but i want to put six characters okay So this basically will set the password as six characters. Okay, let me just go to attributes again. Okay, I also want to include password uh, special characters zero. Okay, so you will not have any special characters. Okay. Okay. So what are the um, so what are different options available okay so you want to see what are the different options available to for you to add right uh, if you click on this uh, effective options effective options so you can see all the parameters which are available for you to uh, use okay so let me just cancel that like that ones so here are the ones which are basically available for you to maintain okay so these are the things where you can maintain and then you can exclude certain people from this so once you create this profile here then you need to go to su01 You have to go to this uh, logon tab. You have to set the policy here. So you can add the policy here. In this case, if I add arrows here, this policy, then my password length will be only six characters. Okay, thanks for watching the video. Please click on the link below to download a step by step SAP GRC guide. Thank you.